Hey folks, you can see my license plate is gone. Um, and I just wanted to submit this as proof that I don't baby my bikes off-road. I might, I might, you know, ride street bikes here and there. That's just because I like trying different bikes. Um, but this is still an adventure channel. So, uh, my wheel caught my license plate and it looks a lot worse. Like, hold on. Right there. And this is all like bendy right here. So I must have broken something. So I gotta figure out a solution uh, for this after I hammer out my plate. Uh, you can tell that bolts are gone. I have zip ties holding the bottom part that holds my luggage rack on and I, and I don't know what holds the top. I mean, it's essentially been torn loose from its mountings. I don't even know if the rear brake light works. Uh, Yeah, it looks like there's supposed to be a bolt up in there. And from what I can feel with my hand, I don't think I stripped it. I don't think I stripped it at all. I still think it's all right. Um, oh, you can see here that bent piece of metal right there. I'm thinking when this came up, it smashed into that. Yep. Ryan just breaking shit. Anyway. So, I'm going to go figure this out, guys. Um, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, you know, Hanukkah, whatever you guys say. Happy Holidays to everyone out there. Uh, but, yeah, I just wanted to get rid of the stigma that street bikes can't do off-road, because they can. I mean, you may end up with a bent license plate, but that's hardly that bad, right? So, anyway, I'm going to oil my chain. See you guys later. If you like the channel, like, subscribe, and share. All right, license plate is now bent outwards away from the tire. I don't know if you can see in there. Let's see what I can do with this camera. Uh, let's see. There we go. I'll use... We've got a silver shiny bolt. That's a new one. It's not all the way put in because I'm lazy. Um, I'll get that done. But underneath you can see a huge fender washer there to distribute the weight. Same on the other side. You can actually see the other side better. Huge fender washer distributes the weight. These are M6 bolts. Um, and I'm hoping that'll beef up this system right here. That it'll hold everything down even when the going gets rough. I lock this down uh, fairly well. And I even replace the seat bolts because when you have a rack like, you know, like this... It takes up uh, the same bolt mount thing that your rear seat does. And then your rear seat bolts are too short. And then you end up having to squish everything down and you hate your life. So, I just got longer ones. Same size as well. Um, I just made those shorter. This side doesn't have it because I'm um, like, that bolt didn't come out. So, I'm just going to leave that there. So, hopefully, this will fix, quote unquote, fix my tire hitting and rubbing against the license plate issue. So yeah, thinking about taking the bike out. Uh, we'll see uh, if I want to take it out this week. It's a bit chilly, but I think that's okay, right? 